So now, if you don't already know this, if you don't already have an EV like I do, uh, then here's some news for you. In most cases, most power companies around the company give you a choice of electrical plans to be on. Right, right. The, the most popular one, only because it's the default plan that everybody goes on, is the residential the plan. standard residential flat rate type deal. Flat rate, one rate, most of the year. Right. I'm not going to get too far into that. Right. But it's basically one flat rate. Um, and you know what? I don't blame folks if they don't know how much they're getting charged. Well, the bill, like Georgia Power, they don't necessarily give you the details to the nitty gritty. They kind of give you an estimate, you know, all the roundabout, you know, just kind of, they don't really break it down. Like, you know. When it comes to figuring out your bill, Georgia Power is a mess. Yeah. And at this point, I'm convinced, I'm absolutely convinced, it is an intentional mess. Oh, because man. If you ever looked at your power bill, I'm, I'm speaking specifically to watch Georgia Power. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Uh, but it's the God on this truth. Yeah. If you actually look at your Georgia Power bill, you it is impossible for you to figure out how much you're actually pay, paying per kilowatt hour. Oh, go, I know. Go look at yeah. your bill. Oh, you're yeah. from Georgia? Go look at your, look go at look your bill. bill. Yeah. It's and impossible. In fact, there's actually another impossibility. It is impossible to get in touch with a human being. <laughs> In customer service for Georgia Power. So there's that too. <laughs> I've had to wait. Yeah. It's happened. A it's happened. Times. It, I mean, it recently. Happened. And within the last two years. It, it's happened, but I'm not going to say it wasn't without its trials and tribulations. Yeah, it's, but why do they not just put the simple base rate on your plan? I don't know, but they don't do this. Mm -hmm. they, they, I've seen other power companies do it. So there are some power companies out there that do it. In the case of Georgia Power, they absolutely don't do it. And in fact, to try to figure out exactly how much you're paying per kilowatt hour, uh, you've got some serious mathematics to do. Uh, you've got to go into at least three or four different tariff sheets, do calculations, and then it's based on percentage of power used, and then it's per... Uh, ugh, it's a mess. It's, it's a, a mess. It's a hot mess. Uh, Look. You know, uh, don't they have a, also time of day on the standard residential? No. No, oh, it's a not flat rate. Standard, no, oh, yeah, that's a it's flat a flat rate. rate all the way around, even at nighttime, which could be expensive. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. So in the case of Georgia Power, once you add in all of the tariffs and all the taxes, mm -hmm. and even then, after I've done all the math, this is still an estimate. I'm, I'm within a penny or two, though. I guarantee okay. I'm within a penny or two. It's 18 cents per kilowatt hour. Mm. I'm wow. sorry, 17 cents per kilowatt hour. Right. I, I, just, I just misspoke. It's 17 cents per kilowatt hour.